Hey y'all, it's your girl Tamika J, and we are here again with another segment of Wine Down with Tamika J, and we have La Vie, an amazing, amazing artist. Let's cheers to that. Absolutely. Let's drink up. You said you like this wine before too. Mm-hmm. It's sweet too. Is that Very sweet nice. red? Yes. So nice. La Vie. Yeah. She actually was actually when I did my first wind down with Tamika J. She was there with my humble beginnings. And so when it was just my computer and that was it. So, right. but, but you rocked with this. So thank Absolutely. you for Absolutely. that. So after that, what have you been up to? Oh man, um, I've been on a constant journey mm -hmm. of um, learning who I am mm -hmm. and being comfortable with who I am mm -hmm. and um, also growing as an artist, yes. um, as an individual. Mm -hmm. So um, I've been doing a lot of that, mm -hmm. um, soul searching, yeah. you know, for lack of a better word. Um, definitely continuing my journey as a mom and a wife. Yeah. yeah. And remind everyone how many kids you have. I have three babies. Uh, my daughter is 13 and I have twin boys that are three. Yay. Oh, wow. And you still um, look good. <laughs> yes. And um, it's a good deal. Sometimes it's um, tiring. <laughs> but, yes, I'm sure. But um, the, the end result, the, mm -hmm. where I want to be, is definitely um, a, a, a way for me to, be, to remain encouraged. Amen to yeah, that. For sure. So I know the last time we spoke, um, when the humble beginnings of Wind Down with Tamika J, mm -hmm. um, we, we talked about um, depression. And so you revealed that you that, that was something that you went through um, at a certain season of, in your life. Mm -hmm. um, can you tell the viewers, like, how did you overcome that? Uh, how, did I over, how did I overcome it? Um, I overcame it by simply making the decision that I didn't want to live in that state anymore. Mm -hmm. um, it started within myself mm -hmm. um, and also me changing my perspective and the way that I view things, mm -hmm. a lot of times when you're in a situation, it's kind of hard for you to see the light at the <laughs> at the yeah. end of the tunnel. But um, definitely staying in my word and um, oh, yes. you know keeping connecting with keeping connected with my church family and mm -hmm. you know having my sisters and my brothers to encourage me yeah. um, is great. You know what I mean. Mm -hmm. So um, right now, I I can honestly say that I am not. I am absolutely not dealing with that. <laughs> and I'm to that. Like, oh, thank God. Yes, thank God feel, for deliverance. Yeah, because I felt like it was something that was going to be with me forever. Do you feel like more, um, especially more female artists need to talk more about um, depression? Because this industry is not for, um, for the weak. Mm -hmm. So do you feel like we, we need to talk more about it? Because I'm sure there's a lot of you know, artists out there who are depressed. Do you feel like there's, that's something that we need to talk more about? I think people should definitely be uh, more open about just themselves, be more real, mm -hmm. more transparent about mm -hmm. who they are. Mm -hmm. um, if you're having a great day and somebody's like, how are you doing? Just be like, I'm having a great day. But if you're not, say it. Like, yeah. it's so, it, like there, you don't have to say, oh, I'm having a great day, it's yeah. going great, and yes. <laughs> yeah. Like, why? <laughs> just be real. with. Today kind of suck, and yeah. um, later it'll be better. Exactly. Boom. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I, I think people should just be real with themselves, That's for true. sure. And I think it'll just kind of <laughs> help everybody else. Yeah. To not I feel agree. like they have to put on this facade. Yeah. That's for really sure. important. Now I know that you are um, you are working on an EP. Yes. So can you tell the viewers a little bit about the EP? And I actually got a chance to listen to one of the songs, and yes. it is so dope. Because, you know, I'm all about queen and woman empowerment. Mm -hmm. So can you tell the viewers, like, what, what can we expect from the CP? Um, you can expect some reggae. Oh, you can right expect now. some compa, mm -hmm. some um, of my culture um, mm -hmm. coming uh, from a Haitian background. Uh, there, there is a lot, a lot, a lot of music and a lot of artists out there who I've listened to yeah. and um, try to glean from. Yeah. And so I'm um, gonna try to incorporate That's good. some of the sounds mm -hmm. of, of my culture, but also incorporate who I am, you exactly. know? So if I scat on a reggae. Yeah, that would be dope <laughs> if, Or if I yeah. scat on some compa, like don't judge it. Just, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just kind of go with it. I'm just kind of trying it out. 
Um, but I'm really, really excited. Um, mm -hmm. I have uh, Jay Vibe, um, mm -hmm. who is the producer of Sent From Heaven mm -hmm. um, with Keisha Cole. Oh, he did okay. uh, the first track. The single oh, that we're going to release. Let's toast so, to that. I'm excited. Hell yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. I love that. I'm super, super excited. Um, he is a friend of the family. And, and it's been a long time. I'm like, when are you going to produce a track for me? Yo? Yeah. Like, and he finally did it. And finally yes. he got it. And so that's the title track. It's called Queen. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be released in July. I don't have a date yet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I don't want to kind of put something yeah out and there. then it doesn't happen and then it's like yeah oh. so i want to take my time and yeah um, i'm excited i'm excited Oops. really 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 excited i yeah. don't know i'm just you giddy look go I ahead. Am. Get, it. <laughs> get it all out <laughs> i'm super super excited because okay it's something that's comfortable for me mm -hmm. you know I, yeah. you know every time people hear me they're like you're a jazz singer right yeah. you 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 might you have to do jazz yeah and i'm like mm, no, no, you don't want to do that. Yeah, yeah, like that's not specifically what, what you I do. Are. I exactly. can. Yeah. But that's not specifically what I do. Yeah. So I just, I'm, I'm going to just label it soul music. That's all. Yeah. That's it. And that's it. I like that. It's good. I, I like love, it. love, love, love that. So as so we know that the EP is coming out. Mm -hmm. Now, are there, I know that you were on tour. Now, do you have any plans to go, um, just have a La Vie tour? That would be... Fabulous. <laughs> that would be fabulous. But um, at this time, no, not, not yet. But we're going to put it out. We're going to speak it out into existence. Right. Absolutely. <laughs> um, but I, de I definitely want to um, get out there and do different shows, even outside of the state of Florida, so that I yes. can kind of expand mm -hmm. um, with uh, the different exactly. bands. So, yeah, I mean, I want to get on the road, and my plan is to do that but yeah. um you got to be very strate strategic with to. what you're yeah. doing so gotta take my time and plus i have kids i have to make would you sure take your kids on the road like a big like you know bus would you actually take them or would you leave them here no <laughs> you said no <laughs> what are you saying? usually people are like yes of course absolutely I'll, not. I'll get to be closer with my kids you say mm -hmm. no i love them to itty bitty little pieces <laughs> but no no, no. No. That's funny. Because even if their father is there, even if grandma is there, even mm -hmm. if everybody in the world is there, yeah. they're going to come to me yeah. and say, Mommy, can I have some juice? Yeah. And I'm going to be like, uh, yeah. go sit down. You're, you're like warming up, like trying to get your vocals <laughs> warmed like, up, and then yeah. the kid wants some no, juice. No, it'll be a distraction, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't be giving 100%. Honest. Yeah. Honestly, it well, would not be honest. good. Yeah, no. So I know before um, we were talking about support and everything, how do you feel um, is the support here in South Florida is? Um, sometimes the support is great, mm -hmm. and sometimes it isn't. Um, in those times where it isn't, I have to kind of remind myself that um, the reason that I'm doing this is because I, I love music. Mm -hmm. And um, not necessarily, it's great to be able, you know, I, I tell when I'm, you know, doing my little shows or whatever, I'm just like, you know, I'm thankful that all of you are here. Yeah. Because I would hate to be singing to chairs. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. So thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate mm -hmm. you for coming, you mm -hmm. know? Um, so I just kind of try to keep focus on the reason why I'm doing it. The reason is not um, for anything more than I love music. Yeah. And this is what I, be, I believe I was yeah. created to do. So I'm, I just want to do it. Mm, I love that. So I got to stay focused. Exactly. Focused. What would you say to a younger Lavi? I would, oh man. <laughs> You're like, she oh, wins. Huh? <laughs> Isn't that um, much? <laughs> I would say, let it go. Mm. Um, there are a lot of things that I held on to. Oh my God, from like my mom, my dad, like, you know, stuff like, yeah. it's like, okay, uh, this happened like years yeah. ago. It's okay to forgive and forget. And a lot of times we don't have it. We don't have an opportunity for the person who we feel hurt us, mm. um, for them to say, I'm sorry. Yeah. So we have to find a way to resolve within ourselves that, yeah. you know, this yeah. has made me a better person. So all of the things that I've gone through in my life, um, I wouldn't want to take any of them back because today yeah. it, it, I, I am who I am mm -hmm. because of all of the, all of the things that I was just like, oh, this is so whack. Like, yeah. why did I have, you know, why am I going through this? Or yeah. why? 
because it's brought me to today. Mm. And are you proud of yourself? Good. I am very, very. Oh, I am. <laughs> That's a good question to ask. I am very proud of myself. And I, I like to say that because you know, yeah. you about to cry. I'm emotional. <laughs> Because I, I am. Because I am. I'm very. Because I, I think, you know, um, and I know how it is. Artist to artist, mm -hmm. we're very hard on ourselves. Mm -hmm. I know I am. <laughs> and, you know, a lot of times, you know, um, in some kind of way, shape, or form, we kind of seek validation. In some kind of way or shape mm -hmm. or form. Absolutely. You know, and, and so a lot of times we don't validate ourselves. Mm -hmm. So it's good to once, you know, it's good to just say, I'm proud of myself. I had to one time tell myself that, you know, and I was like, I'm proud of you, Tamika. So, and I'm proud of you, Lavi. Yeah, man. And I want the viewers to even be more proud of you. So can you tell them where they can find you? So they can stalk hey. you. <laughs> hey there. Stalk my page. <laughs> um, you can find me at La V Music, L A V I E Music, at on most on all social media, and um, my website is www.lavie-music.com. So La V L A V I E dash music.com. Amazing. And once again, you can find me. Your homegirl, Tamika J, www.tamikajmusic.com. And you can find me on all social media with at Tamika J Music. And of course, stay tuned for another amazing segment of Wind Down with Tamika J. Toast! Clink, 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 clink. Peace. This is really good, though. Who loves really good. I didn't want to like gulp it, but it's really, really good. This is good. I like this one.